being woke, is this something that is inspired by recent events or does this go back to your college years? Where does this thinking and analysis start for you? For being woke, <laughs> it's like my life goal <laughs> is to just be woke. <laughs> Um, but I think it just, yeah, it's just been sprouting. It's been there for a long time. I really believe that every single human that came to this planet has a purpose and something divine within them that they've, they've brought with them. And I think that it's, it, it's came with me and it's been there sprouting, manifesting, affirming and boiling and seasonings, lots of seasonings. And, you know, now that I've always been interested in social justice work. So since this situation of all the protesters, and I'm looking at the rage and the emotion, I'm like, we have to also get some intellect behind that. There's no way that we can just have emotion and no, no information behind it. So that's why woke just sprouted. It just, it just popped in my mind. What is the one thing my goal for my personal self-development is to become conscious, to become woke on not just the issues that affect me in my life, because I am privileged in one way, you know, in comparison to even some of my own relatives that live in Dominican Republic. So I want to become woke and conscious on what's going on even in my own motherland, you know, and around the world. And the project is to get as many conscious people because we cannot show up to any space not knowing, because that's the problem. We lack the knowledge, we lack the information. When we lack the information, we make ignorant choices. Where do you uh, see yourself with your organization in the future? And what would you like to see it accomplish? So I would love to see the Woke Project being able to establish a space where we can continuously have open doors and a safe space for all different kinds of people to educate on various subjects. Um, I would love to be able to work with like the educational system and the youth. I feel like the youth, we need to focus on the youth because when we're young, our brains are most impressionable and they are the leaders of our next generation. I wanna teach specifically young women of color their worth, their value, even though society tells them that they're unworthy, I want them to know that they are strong, that they are powerful, that they are, you know, they're needed in our communities because I feel like women will be the next, the next lead in this, in this world. Is that right? Yes, I do. <laughs> and do you think we'll see a, a female president of the United States soon? <laughs> soon, <laughs> I hope. And I just really, really want to see um, representatives and politicians that are really stepping up to the plate and hold compassion and empathy and really are listening to the people. I think that we have a lot of politicians that, you know, are are very p power hungry and it's disturbing. That's not the purpose of your role. And if you feel like you can't put your ego to the side, then you need to step aside. Um, but yeah, I really hope that we can get a female, a female president because I know a lot of countries around the world are starting to, to, to get some female presidents. Final thoughts. <laughs> okay. final, 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 thought. final, final times final thoughts. Uh, yeah, show up as you, like pursue knowledge, pursue education. I would say to my woman of color, to women, women of color, please, please, you are meant more than to be just nurturers and people pleasers. Connect with the same vibration that you're giving. You know, find people who are consistent that are gonna show up for you just like you'll show up for them. Um, and then don't be afraid of your voice. I think sometimes we, we get scared that we're gonna say something that's not deemed appropriate or you know, maybe you wanna dance a little and that's you. Whatever that looks like, just show up as you and, and whoever doesn't wanna receive it, pa' fuera. Thanks for watching streettv.net. 
If you're not subscribed, please hit that button below and click the bell to receive alerts and notifications. Feel free to comment below so you can give us your feedback and be sure to watch the two related episodes to the right. If you want to support this platform or follow us on social media, visit the links in the description. And thanks for watching StreetTV.net.